Hello everyone. Do you know that more than 35 million people in the United States may have some level of kidney disease and many of them don't even know it? Kidney disease is a serious condition that can affect your heart bones, immune system, and even your brain. It can also lead to kidney failure, which requires dialysis or a transplant to survive. But did you know that some of your daily habits you do every day without thinking can be damaging your kidneys without you knowing about it? Today we're discussing eight bad habits that can damage your kidneys and how to stop them before it's too late. Your kidneys play a vital role in filtering waste from your blood regulating blood pressure, and maintaining fluid balance. Let's dive into the top eight bad habits that can harm your kidneys. Number one, overuse of painkillers. The overuse of painkillers, particularly non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs, NSAIDs, like ibuprofen and naproxen, can be detrimental to your kidneys. These medications are commonly used to alleviate pain and reduce inflammation but when taken in excessive amounts or for extended periods, they can cause kidney damage. NSAIDs work by blocking the production of prostaglandins, which are hormone-like substances that play a role in inflammation and pain. However, prostaglandins also help regulate blood flow to the kidneys. When NSAIDs inhibit their production, the kidneys may receive less blood flow, leading to potential kidney injury. Additionally, long-term use of NSAIDs can lead to a condition called analgesic nephropathy, which is characterized by gradual kidney damage and decline in function. Symptoms may not be noticeable until significant damage has occurred. To minimize the risk of kidney damage, it's important to use NSAIDs as directed and only when necessary. If you require pain relief on a regular basis, consult with your healthcare provider to explore alternative options that are safer for your kidneys. Always follow the recommended dosage and duration of use to protect your kidney health. Number two, excessive salt intake. Excessive salt intake is a common yet harmful habit that can damage your kidneys. The kidneys play a crucial role in maintaining the body's electrolyte balance, including sodium levels. When you consume too much salt, your kidneys have to work harder to excrete the excess sodium. Over time, this can lead to high blood pressure, also known as hypertension. Hypertension is a major risk factor for kidney disease, as it can damage the blood vessels in the kidneys and impair their ability to filter waste from the blood. Additionally, high salt intake can increase the risk of kidney stones, as the excess sodium can combine with calcium in the urine to form crystals. To protect your kidneys, it's important to limit your salt intake to the recommended daily amount, which is no more than 2,300 mg per day for most adults. This can be achieved by avoiding processed and packaged foods, which are often high in sodium, and instead opting for fresh fruits and vegetables. Additionally, using herbs and spices to flavor your food instead of salt can help reduce your sodium intake. 3. Not drinking enough water Keep your kidneys healthy by being water-wise. This means drinking the right amount of water for you. A common misconception is that everyone should drink eight glasses of water per day, but since everyone is different, daily water needs will vary by person. How much water you need is based on differences in age, climate, exercise intensity, as well as states of pregnancy, breastfeeding, and illness. According to Kidney Foundation, about 60-70% of your body weight is made up of water, and every part of your body needs it to function properly. Water helps the kidneys remove wastes from your blood in the form of urine. Water also helps keep your blood vessels open so that blood can travel freely to your kidneys and deliver essential nutrients to them. But if you become dehydrated, then it is more difficult for this delivery system to work. Mild dehydration can make you feel tired and can impair normal bodily functions. Severe dehydration can lead to kidney damage, so it is important to drink enough when you work or exercise very hard, and especially in warm and humid weather. Here are some tips to make sure you're drinking enough water and to keep your kidneys healthy. Eight is great, but not set in stone. There is no hard and fast rule that everyone needs eight glasses of water a day. This is just a general recommendation based on the fact that we continually lose water from our bodies and that we need adequate water intake to survive and optimal amounts to thrive. The Institute of Medicine has estimated that men need approximately 13 cups, 
2.3 liters of fluid daily, and that women need approximately 9 cups 2.2 liters of fluid daily. Less is more if you have kidney failure, aka end-stage kidney disease. When the kidneys fail, people don't excrete enough water, if any at all. For those who are receiving dialysis treatment, water must actually be greatly restricted. It's possible to drink too much water. Though it is not very common for this to happen in the average person, endurance athletes like marathoners may drink large amounts of water and thereby dilute the sodium level in their blood, resulting in a dangerous condition called hyponatremia. Your urine can reveal a lot. For the average person, water-wise means drinking enough water or other healthy fluids, such as unsweetened juice or low-fat milk to quench thirst and to keep your urine light yellow or colorless. When your urine is dark yellow, this indicates that you are dehydrated. You should be making about 1.5 liters of urine daily, about 6 cups. 4. Ignoring the urge. Ignoring the urge to urinate is a habit that can have negative effects on your kidneys and overall urinary health. When you delay or ignore the urge to urinate, urine can remain in your bladder for longer periods, increasing the risk of urinary tract infections, UTIs, and bladder issues. Additionally, holding in urine regularly can weaken the muscles of the bladder over time, leading to issues with bladder control. This can result in urinary incontinence, where you may experience leaks or an inability to control your urine flow. Furthermore, chronic retention of urine can put pressure on the kidneys and increase the risk of developing kidney stones or kidney infections. The kidneys rely on a steady flow of urine to remove waste and toxins from the body. Holding in urine can disrupt this process and potentially harm your kidneys. To maintain good urinary health and protect your kidneys, it's important to respond to your body's signals and empty your bladder regularly. If you frequently experience a strong urge to urinate or have difficulty controlling your bladder, it's advisable to consult a healthcare professional for further evaluation and guidance. 5. Poor diet choices. Poor diet choices can significantly impact kidney health, as evidenced by numerous studies linking certain dietary patterns to an increased risk of kidney damage and disease. Diets high in processed foods, sugar, and unhealthy fats have been shown to contribute to inflammation, high blood pressure, and obesity, all of which are risk factors for kidney disease. For example, a study published in the Journal of the American Society of Nephrology found that individuals with a high intake of red and processed meats, sweets, and high-fat dairy products had an increased risk of developing chronic kidney disease. Another study published in the Clinical Journal of the American Society of Nephrology showed that a diet rich in fruits, vegetables, whole grains, and fish was associated with a lower risk of kidney stones. These findings underscore the importance of making healthy dietary choices to protect kidney health and reduce the risk of kidney disease. 6. Not getting enough sleep. Not getting enough sleep can have serious consequences for kidney health as supported by a growing body of research. A study published in the journal Sleep Medicine Reviews found that individuals who consistently slept less than six hours per night were at a higher risk of developing chronic kidney disease. This is believed to be due to disruptions in the body's hormonal balance and increased inflammation associated with inadequate sleep. Furthermore, a study published in the Clinical Journal of the American Society of Nephrology revealed that short sleep duration was associated with a higher prevalence of kidney stones. This suggests that insufficient sleep may disrupt the body's ability to regulate minerals and waste products, increasing the likelihood of kidney stone formation. These findings highlight the importance of prioritizing adequate sleep to support kidney health and reduce the risk of kidney disease and other related conditions. 7. Smoking Smoking is a well-established risk factor for kidney damage and disease, supported by extensive research. A study published in the American Journal of Kidney Diseases showed that smokers were more likely to develop proteinuria, a condition where abnormal amounts of protein are found in the urine, which is an early sign of kidney damage. Another study published in the Journal of the American Society of Nephrology found that smoking was associated with a faster decline in kidney function over time.
This is believed to be due to the harmful effects of cigarette smoke on the blood vessels in the kidneys, which can lead to reduced blood flow and kidney damage. Additionally, smoking is a major risk factor for kidney cancer, with smokers being twice as likely to develop the disease compared to non-smokers. These findings underscore the importance of quitting smoking to protect kidney health and reduce the risk of kidney disease and cancer. 8. Lack of Exercise Lack of exercise is a significant risk factor for kidney disease, supported by compelling evidence from various studies. Research published in the American Journal of Kidney Diseases found that individuals who engaged in regular physical activity had a lower risk of developing chronic kidney disease compared to those who were inactive. Physical activity is believed to improve kidney function by reducing inflammation, regulating blood pressure, and improving cardiovascular health. Furthermore, a study published in the Clinical Journal of the American Society of Nephrology demonstrated that regular exercise was associated with a lower risk of kidney stones. Exercise helps maintain a healthy weight and reduces the risk of obesity, which is a risk factor for kidney stones. In conclusion, there are several bad habits that can damage your kidneys. By avoiding these habits and adopting a healthy lifestyle, you can protect your kidneys and overall health. If you have any concerns about your kidney health, be sure to speak with your healthcare provider.